In the beginning, Mitcham Common was completely flat. Its poor acid soils lie over rich gravels and are infertile. For generations, the area provided only rough grazing, firewood and turf. The gorse was much valued for bread ovens as it burns fast and fiercely. In the 19th century, gravel extraction for road building became very profitable and the scale of operations increased steadily as new pumps and machinery were developed. George Parker Bidder, a successful barrister, watched with growing dismay the damage done to the common by gravel extraction and turf digging and he called a public meeting. Here he was asked to organise the legal framework to establish an independent board of conservators to manage the common and this was completed in 1891. In 1896, Bidder died unexpectedly after a street accident and a monument was erected in gratitude for his work to preserve the common.